Hey guys, welcome back and thanks for tuning in to Intricate. Charleston White is a former Texas gang member who, after nearly a decade in prison for some fairly major adolescent offenses, has now finally managed to turn his life around by sharing his story on social media and tossing in some controversial views along the way. He also presents himself as the CEO and founder of HYPE, which stands for Helping Young People Excel. But for all that good he appears to be doing for his community, what really grabs people's attention is the way he refuses to mince words and never backs down from a seemingly never-ending barrage of his controversial views on certain celebrities and others. Today, we'll be talking about his latest controversy, so stay tuned. Charleston White and T.I. have just recently found themselves embroiled in a nasty feud after the YouTuber threatened the rapper's son. We all know that T.I. doesn't play about his kids, so when the controversial YouTuber Charleston White had some things to say about King Harris, we knew his father would not remain silent for long. The feud has come after Junior King was arrested in September this year, although the reason for his arrest has not yet been confirmed to the media and public. The main drama began last week when White launched an unprovoked rant about King Harris and rapper Bootsy Badass's son Tootie Raw. Well, social media users have been closely following the beef. White actually started the video by targeting Bootsy and his son, criticizing his parenting choices. He made a remark about Tootie Raw's street persona, referring to him as soft and sheltered. White then mentioned King Harris, saying he doesn't like him either and wishes that both of them would go to jail to learn a lesson. To further worsen the matter, White continued his rant against Harris, questioning the teen's ability to fight someone. In another video, White stated he thinks neither King nor Tootie can spell, and he said, I challenge you all to a spelling bee. I bet neither one of you can spell the Appalachian Mountains or Mississippi. Harris, like his father, was not going to tolerate the disrespect. The 18-year-old fired back the following day and took to Instagram to make explicit threats against White. He chastised the YouTuber for appearing tough on camera while fleeing a previous brawl. He eventually told White that the next time he saw him face to face, he would beat his. White continued to speak on Harris, not to be outdone by the 18-year-old, and held nothing back about his feelings for Harris and his father, T.I. Boy, your mama and daddy raised a yellow freak, he said. T.I., that's the kind of boys you raising? You got your yellow son saying he would jump a 50-something-year-old? White even told the rapper he wasn't afraid to lay hands on his son. Say, T.I., look, if your boy jumps on me, y'all will bury that little mf -er. He continued, and while the internet awaited a response from the King of the South, White informed the Harris family that he had contacted authorities. White told the viewers he has tagged the social media handles of the Atlanta Police Department and Fulton County District Attorney Fannie Willis to alert them about a video in which King threatened him. Also added that all he wants is for King to be in prison. And that was all Papa Harris needed to hear. T.I. then came to King's defense, got involved, and addressed the issue during an Instagram Live on the same day and let White know that they really need to talk now. He asked White to deal with him instead of his son, like, come deal with the daddy, the actor and rapper said. If you don't want any trouble, what do you keep kicking dust up for? If you're scared to show up somewhere, that's fear. I don't operate in fear. I don't need any security around me. White didn't make time to speak with T.I. because he still has some things to get off his chest about his disrespectful son. But the rubber band man artist was finally taken off the block call list and made it through to speak with White. Just got off the phone with T.I. and you don't get to dictate nothing, he said. T.I., according to White, stated that he was just trying to get an understanding, to which he responded, I ain't trying to give no understanding. If you can't take what I took, then crash out. Send whoever you need to, he went on. But when his quiet attempt to resolve the issue was denied, T.I. jumped on his Instagram account and spoke his mind, reminding us that he's a legendary wordsmith. The clip started with T.I. letting White know, I'll stick my foot so far up your you'll be flossing your teeth with my shoelaces. He said a lot to White, but his main point was, don't play with mine. Well, it was clear that no solution could be agreed upon by the two entities somewhere soon. And you know what? We have seen some pretty popular involvement here. That is, filmmaker Dion Taylor also weighed in on the argument and slammed White for his recent comments and threats. In a video posted to Instagram, which T.I. reshared on his own profile, Dion said, this dude was on Instagram talking crazy like killing his son, shooting him in the throat, and I commented. My comment was very simple. It was like, yo, we can't sit here and let nobody write something like that. He further added, I'm not sure what the backstory was, but when I saw the video, I thought, there's no way in the world we can have someone write on a page who's going to shoot someone's son. Well, 
We don't know what prompted White to choose these teenagers as his targets. It appears that he is in over his head. However, aside from the active protection of his parents, the young adult has a whole tribe behind him. Like his elder sister, Sonika Pullins was also in the news for how she felt about people coming for her brother. She kept on tweeting her thoughts on people's negative perceptions of her sibling as the beef raged on and defended him by pleading with the fans to show the young man some grace. Well, should the Harris clan step in and defend King no matter what? Or should they let him fight his own battles? Do let us know how you feel about it in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video, do leave us a like. For more on the latest in pop culture, subscribe to our channel and turn on the notifications as well. Time to take your leave now. Take care, folks. Goodbye.